many of us know of Buck Wheeler and know the innovative things that he's brought to the industry and know that he's a horseman uh, and knows about the behavior of horses. And uh, the products that he's brought to us are products that, uh, that help us, that assist us in tough problems on, on the daily life of a horse farm. Um, and uh, once you see his products and utilize them, you find that his way of thinking and solving problems is a, is a way that helps you out on a daily basis, especially with the, with the mare milker. Ounce for ounce, nothing impacts a pedigreed foal's future performance quite like colostrum, a mayor's first milk. Research proves that absorption of high quality antibody and protein rich colostrum consumed at the right time and in the proper amount provides a foal its greatest level of defense and protection against infection, morbidity, and mortality in the critical first year of life. The Utterly Easy Milker works effectively on a broad range of species. Use the small cylinder to accommodate small or maiden mares, llamas, sheep, goats, or miniature cows. Use the larger cylinder to extract milk from mares suffering from mastitis or for large breed mares. The Utterly Easy Milker also has been shown to work effectively on certain exotic species like zebras and camels in zoos and other controlled environments. When it comes to obtaining equine milk and colostrum, nothing's easier than the Utterly Easy Mayor Milker. Here's Buck Wheeler to demonstrate. You want to make sure that this bag is sufficiently cleaned off. Be sure and wipe down both teeth and make sure that that bag is totally clean before that foal has a chance to nurse. And the very next thing we need to do is make sure that the wax plugs are out of the bottom of the teats and at least get milk started. We've got that colostrum flowing before we apply the pump. So this is very critical before we start. We want to make sure that it's working. Now we're ready to withdraw the colostrum. This is the 60 cc syringe size. We uh, tapered the top of it so it fits the bag and the teat very, very comfortably. It's very rounded on top, soft, so it's totally non-invasive. We have another size that's a little bit larger for those mares that have had mastitis or for the larger uh, draft mares that they're using for nurse mares. So this fits, however, the number one and they're numbered one and two in the front of them is the majority that you use on the majority of the mares. As we go up, about to go up underneath of this bag, it's very critical. Just take and tilt this bottle back a little bit towards the pump because it's, it's a vacuum pump, so it's critical that that has to be tied up against there. As we go up underneath the teat, make sure that it's centered. We start the pumping process. After about the third squeeze, we should be start, it should be start to draw the milk. And here, here comes the colostrum. As long as the milk is running, stop pumping. And then it slows down, you can start pumping again, and it, it brings it back in. To break the seal, just simply tilt back the bottle towards the pump handle. It releases the vacuum and comes right off from the teat. Now that we've collected enough colostrum, about four to six ounces here, we're gonna go ahead and put it in a nurse bottle for this baby and get it into it right away. Just simply pour the colostrum into the bottle. It's very important to get the colostrum into these babies as soon as possible. It's been our experience and what we've noticed in the last five years of the research and development of the Utterly Easy is the fact that we get that warm colostrum in there, the antibodies are working, plus the fact that these babies start that sucking reaction. So when they get up, they're ready to go right to the uh, bread basket, so to speak. It's very critical because, as you can see, this baby's going right after that colostrum. And like I said previously, it teaches them that sucking reaction, re a reflex action. So when he starts after that mare, um, he's going to get up and go right to the bread basket, which will, once he rises, you'll be able to see that. 
it, it's really feeling good to him at this point. Always make sure you don't try and squeeze that bottle too hard or you're forcing that baby to suck because it's a very strong possibility sometimes that it could go down the wrong windpipe and get into the lungs and that's not a good idea. But when they've got their tongue wrapped around that nipple like they have right here, everything's going in the right place. And uh, he just about got this uh, 8 to 10 ounces, probably what was in there, uh, gone at this point. Nothing gives newborns a healthier start than all-natural, antibody-rich colostrum. And nothing protects the significant investment in foals better than the controlled administration of high-quality colostrum in the first critical hours of life. The utterly easy mare milker will help maximize any foal's ultimate performance potential from the very first feeding. So this mare milking device he's come up with is, is, a, is a godsend to our industry. In your truck or in your clinic, you, you wonder if you're going to make space for a product. Um, and this is a product that I'm making space in my truck for.